Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Andrea Ali. I'm a professional makeup artist based in Paris and in today's video I'm going to talk about the best lip tints, lip balms with a tint that are right now on the market. And I'm going to get straight into it. I've been loving all these new releases because, I mean, who doesn't love a mistake-proof type of lippy? You know, you just put it no matter where you are mirror or not you know it's just so easy to apply it gives you the hydration and a little bit of tint now i have different products that i'm going to talk about some of them are tinted lip balms so they are supposed to really nourish your lips and some of them are just uh, more like uh, very thin uh, lipsticks with a very small amount of color in them because we're gonna get straight into it with the product that I have right now on my lips which is from Bobbi Brown and it's a crushed shine jelly stick it looks like this it's very shiny it's super glowy it feels very very light on the lips but it's not the type of product that would really nourish your lips. I think that if you're looking for that type of product, um, usually products that have lanolin or products that have petrolatum in them are those type of products that will really, really nourish your lips. This is, uh, this is giving you shine, it's giving you color, but it's not deeply nourishing. However, I love the colors available, and this one in particular, it's called Honey Number no. Two. I think it's so, so beautiful. I wanted to include it in this video because not everybody is looking for that very thick, more like a treatment type of product. So this is for those of you wanting a lighter version of a lip tint. Next one is the Essential Lip Enhancer Shine Balm from Jouer and I have this color rose which I think it's really really beautiful. Let's apply it. The color is gorgeous. Very, very similar with the product that I've just talked about from Bobbi Brown in terms of the texture and how it feels. It's like a, it feels more like a lip oil than a lip balm. So it's not incredibly like rich and thick. It's actually very, very lightweight. It feels more, like I said, like a tinted oil. I think the color is beautiful. You don't want to apply too much. I feel like it does build up a bit, but I love the high shine. I love the high shine of this product. They have amazing colors available, but this one is definitely one of my favorite favorites. You could apply it just like that, or you could even, you know, mix it with lip liner and have it for a longer period of time. As soon as you involve a lip liner in your makeup routine, you will see that whatever you've applied on the lips lasts longer. Really love this one, but again, it's not crazy nourishing. Happy Kiss from Charlotte Tilbury is a tinted lip balm, and I think the color that it's really universally beautifying would be Pillow Talk, which I have right here. So let's apply this. Okay, what I gotta say about this product is that it's very thick. It's very, very nourishing, and it's a type of product that, in my opinion, maybe would have been better if it was in a pot, because honestly, if you press a little bit too hard, and I'm not even saying like press a lot, just a little bit more pressure on the bullet, and it will melt on your lips. You will like get, you will have like a big chunk of this product on your lips, However, the product itself, it's very, very nourishing. So this one lasts a good amount of time on your lips. You feel them protected, obviously have this amazing color. And also, I don't know if you could see, 
in comparison with the other ones that were also super high shine, this fills in like the small wrinkles on your lips. It's incredible. Very, I would say very elastic texture. The other ones more, were more like oils. This is very elastic, very lathering, very nourishing. You really feel like it's doing something to your lips. A, a lot of colors are available on this guy. And I have to say this, I'm not being shady, but the exact same <laughs> texture you have on the Maracuja Juicy Lip from Tarte. It's almost like it's the exact same product. I'm gonna apply this one next and you will see it's not the same color, but you guys, it's so similar. It's like so, so similar. The exact same observation I have for this one, by the way, this is in the color Orchid. Maybe it would have been better if it was in a pot and you would have taken with, you know, a little brush and spread it because in this little tube, again, you could apply a little bit too much. It, would, it could end up being too much on the lips. But again, it's so nourishing. I tend to like the the maracuja juicy lip better in terms of the colors. I think they are uh, just a little bit more subtle. Charlotte Tilbury have more pigment, so you'll get a lot more color in these in comparison with this. This is more, the, the tart is just a little bit more, more gentle on the color, but it's the exact same texture, very nourishing, like coating your, your lips with a thick layer of you know protection um, and also it does that thing where the the wrinkles just disappear off your lips this color is gorgeous we gotta admit next is a uh, lano lips rose gold ointment so this is a lip balm with a tint i'm not a huge fan of lip balms in this type of packaging i prefer a tube or an applicator I'm not gonna lie. But this, this color and this texture, with the Lano Lips products, you will feel, you know, they are doing more than just color. It protects your lips, nourishes your lips. It's not just, you know, a little bit of color and that's it. It's really, really protecting your lips, although it's not a very thin, thick consistency so honestly I've applied a, a tiny little bit I've spread it with my finger and it feels good like it feels like a good lip balm you know the one that really nourishes your lips and I, I the color does not bother me at all like I love the color next is the NARS afterglow lip balm and this one in particular it's the color torrid Mm. This is more like something I like to use every day. Okay, this is that type of lip balm that you could apply multiple times a day. It's thin, but it's nourishing in the same time. It has a little bit of tint. It's really not like any of the other colors that I've been talking about. I would say this is the classic tinted lip balm, the one that you could apply multiple times a day. It gives you a slight pinch of color. That's pretty much it. This comes in uh, different colors. I've got, I think I've got them all, but Torrid is definitely my favorite because it has that peach uh, tone without being too orangey. Fantastic. It's like your lips, but better, you know? Next one is, let me, Put the cap brilliant glow and care shine lipstick from gucci i know like this is a lipstick but when i apply it you understand that it feels more like a tinted lip balm this color sally soft honey it's wow i could continue doing this all day long this will never 
feel too heavy. Hopefully this product is just fantastic. It's like the perfect combination between having a nourishing product with a pinch of color and also a lot of shine. Like you can see there's a lot of shine going on on my lips. The type of you know product that fills out the wrinkles but it doesn't feel thick on the lips like that's what I love about it I think they killed it with this formula this packaging I truly truly love it and there are a lot of colors uh, beautiful colors available my favorite is this one next product is from Fenty Beauty it's called Pro Kisser Luscious Lip Balm and I feel like a lot more people should talk about this product because it's fan fantastic it doesn't come in a bullet like all the rest of the products that i that i talked about uh, this one has an applicator so so it feels more like a gloss packaging this is so nice sheer hydrating comfortable just a pinch of color nothing more uh, there's not fragrance in it super super comfortable on the lips and I love the personally love the applicator and again I don't know why not a lot more people talk about this because it's amazing I usually use uh, this on uh, a client that I like I have all the time with just a super nude lip liner and this one in the middle of the lip uh, because she just hates lipstick so just this she is crazy about this combination next is the hyaluronic hydra balm from by terry this is their newest product in the hyaluronic uh, family i have the color dare to bear I actually have all the colors but i feel like this is a nice pinky one A very luxurious formula I would say you do not feel it on the lips you you see the tint but it's not super thick I don't feel any particular scent to it and listen after eight <laughs> times taking uh, the product off my lips I I feel like not taking any of these off because I need uh, I really need protection right now as I've been rubbing my lips so much so it feels good it feels good it feels comfortable a true tinted lip balm one of my personal favorites is this uh, tinted lip balm uh, from Clé de Peau crazy expensive for what it is but I love the packaging you know I'm a sucker for pretty packaging this one is pink on top of you know being slim and pretty and sleek it's also pink which I I love pink. The color is beautiful. It's not as pink as you see it in the packaging. Again, a classic lip balm. It has a little bit of tingling sensation as soon as you have applied it, but nothing uncomfortable. It's just um, more like a minty feeling. Like if you've ever tried the lip balm from La Mer, feels pretty much the same. I love this baby pink. I think it's pretty, it's very summery. It's exactly what you need when you're like on the go. Next is the Givenchy Lip Balm Rose Perfecto. This packaging is so beautiful, so sleek. Love the pink. And then this is what it looks like. Literally just received this Again, there is that fresh feeling on the lips, not like a lip plumper. It's a very, very nice, refreshing feeling on the lips. This is created with more than 95% natural ingredients. I truly love the color. Again, it's this type of lip balm that it is there, but not really. It's very thin on the lips. The type that you don't need a mirror to apply it with. Super, super delicate color, delicate texture. 
delicate packaging. And these were my 10 tinted lip balm options for today's video. Uh, I know that there are a lot more products on the market, but these were uh, the newest one and also the ones that I think you should really give it a try. I truly hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, please give it a thumbs up. Make sure that you're subscribed to my YouTube channel if you haven't subscribed already. Follow me on Instagram where I'm giving you a lot of tips and tricks and I'm doing tutorials on stories as well. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye! The next one is the next one is the Ahens next one is the Ascension next one